All right, what's going on everybody? Hope you're having a shit one. I know I say this in like every video, but it's been a little while. Yeah, today I got I got a good video for you guys. I'll be telling you guys five things that I love about my Mark 7 GTI. And yeah, let's get into it. I'm gonna drive to the spot right now to film, and then yeah. All right, guys, so I'm going to be going over five things that I love about my Mark 7 GTI. And doors open. What the fuck? All right, guys, so I'm going to be going over five things that I love about my Mark 7 GTI. Let's get started. I hope the wind noise isn't too bad in this video because it's kind of windy out. And I'm in, like, an open area. So there might be some wind. Hopefully there's not. We're going to work with what we got. All right, so the first thing I love about my Mark 7 GTI is probably going to be the look. I really like how the Mark 7s look. And I think they look really aggressive. Some people say they look like eggs and they don't like the look of them. But honestly, like, I think they re look really aggressive. I originally wanted uh, the four-door model, but I couldn't find any for sale. And then uh, I settled on the two-door. At first, it was kind of hard to get people in and out the back. But it's honestly not that bad. Plus, I don't even have friends to put in the back. So it's not a big deal. The second thing I love about my Mark 7 is the power potential. So these cars come with, like, 220 horsepower stock. Uh, you can tune it to... Uh, over 400 uh, with the supporting mod these cars uh, you can make pretty quick it's not gonna be no race car or anything but you can make them pretty quick and uh, really fun to drive if you get a downpipe in tune uh, you're making like 350 uh, once you go e85 you're making closer to 400 so yeah these cars have uh, a lot of potential uh, you can even do an upgraded turbo like the is38 from the s3 or golf r or if you want to go big you can get a hybrid and then just get everybody yeah but uh, number two it's got to be the power potential coming in at number three uh this kind of goes along with the second one but it's going to be the aftermarket support there's just so many companies that make parts for this for these cars anything you want like front lip splitters diffusers like literally anything you want to put on your car they make they make it for this car so that's that's a big one because car enthusiasts they want a car that they can modify and personalized to what they want i think this is the perfect car to do so because there's just there's just so much you can do and you can pretty much do whatever you want and stand out from the rest for number four i'm gonna say it's the interior but mainly the seats uh the seats in this car are really uh unique you don't really see these too much they're like plaid and uh first of all they're really comfortable and really great for daily driving but they also just look really cool like you don't see that much on cars these days and uh, i think that's really cool that volkswagen added that it just catches people's eyes and they they always want to talk about the seats for some reason and number five i'm gonna say it's gonna be the handling how this car handles even with stock suspension like i am right now uh, it handles amazing like when you're going through a corner and you just turn it just goes wherever you point it uh it's really it's really crazy how from stock it can it can perform so well um like you're ripping through a corner going like the speed limit or something and like you turn into it and it just it just turns like it feels like it's on rails and i actually do have a coil over sitting at home so stay tuned for that video because this thing's gonna be on the ground pretty soon and i do have an extra kind of bonus one uh it's just gonna be that it's fun to drive uh it's a manual when you're just driving it ripping through corners like whatever uh it's just really fun to drive like you don't have to you don't have to be beating the shit out of it to have fun like you could just go through the gears and it's always a good time so that's gonna be my little bonus thing i like about my car i appreciate you guys for watching and make sure to stay tuned because i got those coilovers i'm gonna be putting on so if you guys want to see that make sure to subscribe and i'll see you guys on the next one peace you know